Hello, I am Vega, the sentient intelligence assigned to Mars. After running diagnostics on the Praetor suit, it appears that I can activate optional challenges that when completed will assist in upgrading your arsenal at an accelerated pace. I have added a tracking component to your dossier. Mission challenges are activated when a mission begins and completing them will reward you with weapon upgrade points. You can view the requirements and track progress in mission tab. Mission, mission tab. Okie dokie. Praetor suit tab allows you to upgrade a variety of the Praetor suit's capabilities. You can spend Praetor suit tokens on upgrades and view requirements to unlock remaining. Environmental resistance, area scanning, equipment system, power up effectiveness, dexterity. Sounds like fun. Main power offline. All entrances not operational. Here we go again. Variety is the spice of death. Is not operational. I got a sweet looking buggy up there. It's so dark. Down, down, down. They're not too happy over there. I believe in honesty, especially now. And what will be your final moments in this world? All the rumors. The human sacrifices, the health portal, the demons, it's all true. My sisters and brothers, be thankful. You will be the first. You will have a seat alongside them just as I will in what will become the new world that they create for us. Starting now. <laughs> Olivia Pierce. Seems like a ton of fun. Area map. Okay. I believe in honesty. Oh, she's talking Especially again. Now. And what What's that? Your final moments in this world. All the rumors. Uh. How do I turn this thing around? Oh, okay. The demons. It's what is that? True. What does that mean? My what's the What's the yellow thing? You will be the first. Oh. You will have a seat. I have to rely on uh, my memory, I think. Especially now. Resource Operations. The Resource Operations Center, referred to as ResOps, was one of the first facilities constructed at the Mars base after the discovery of the Argent Fracture. It encompasses several key areas needed to run the facility, including plasma extraction and processing, isotope stabilization, heavy metal and ore mining, artifact analysis, communications, networking, and off-world transportation. New UAC employees posted to the Mars facility are expected to fulfill a tour of duty and res ops before moving on to their specialized career bracket. Security clearance level 1 allows access to all areas of ResOps, including the Vega network hubs and some satellite control centers. For access to these locations, new advocates must submit a Delta Q Delta form to the departmental and force. Okay. I don't know how much I need to know about that. Bay doors open. 
Oh, they're hungry. Oh, they're hungry. They want a piece of me. My sisters and brothers be thankful. You will have a seat alongside of just Weapon point. So I need oh okay, so I need three of those. What will become the new world that they create for Start. Is that running me? Straight to that box there. Crunch time. No one ammo. Oh, buddy, put some strength into it. What the heck? My sisters and brothers be thankful. What was that? You will be the first. You will have a seat alongside them just as I will in what will become the new world. I can't see anything. For us. I thought I heard a door Stop. opening. No. Like old school Doom style. <gasps> there is something down there. Oh my god. Sit. Tear it apart. I believe in honesty. Especially now. The hell is this? And what will be your final moments in this world? All the rules <laughs> of the human Mate. We've opened a portal back into a back into time. Back in time here. That was a doomed space marine here. These guys don't look old school. Classic map. Oh, mate. Back in time here. Is there anything else here? Is oh, some armor? It's like a special door here or something oh, I guess we just unlocked a map maybe play outside of the game or so all right that was cool it's true <laughs> my sisters and brothers so strange to see it inserted there the oh Mr explosion they create for us Plenty of explosions. All the gibs. All the giblets. Demonic presence at unsafe levels. Lockdown in effect. Oh, here we go. Oh, jeez, everywhere. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> My God. Take it! Crunch! Where you gone? Where you at? Where you at? Oh! Like they may not look like much, but when they hit you, it bloody hurts. To new advocates, and in that vision they saw the future bold and powerful, and the many worked as one to bring the new order. What better words to inspire you as you set out about initiating yourself into the UAC? Those who came before you and those who serve with all operate with the same goal in mind, the development of a new dawn for mankind. It is by this principle of teamwork that we will elevate ourselves to the next plane of existence. 
If you have any suggestions to improve the work environment while working your tenure in Edit ResOps, please submit suggestion from WAD E1M4 to your command controller. However, it is imperative that you learn to accept the things you can't change and follow the path that has been laid out before you. Your service in ResOps is a test to your devotion to the cause. Should you be asked to submit yourself to an interrogation program or experimental treatment, you are expected to comply without question. If a fellow adv advocate asks you to engage in a dedication ceremony, say yes. If you see an advocate doubting their role in the UAC, bring it to the attention of an enforcer so that they may receive the help they need. Don't be selfish. Tier 2 is for everyone. Alright, I don't know how much more of that stuff I need to be. Demonic presence eliminated. Lockdown disengaged. But it is cool, like, I do like the little notes and so on that fill the world out. I don't know, I might, I might keep reading them. Hello there. Yo, old split face. They chainsaw is a specialized melee weapon that can be accessed by pressing G. Talk to your supervisor to see if you need Cutting apart a part of demon with a chainsaw so will always drop a surplus of ammunition. It will cost two, one, three, or five fuel to kill a demon, depending on the size. Upgrading your ammo capacity with Argent cells also increases your fuel capacity. Okay, I just read all that, I think. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Something flashing in there. The UAC. The world is counting on us. How can it be? Get up. Up and over. That wasn't there before. Uh! Bit of ammo. Anything else? What? Okay. More bodies. I see some armor in there. Terrarium. Where? Oh, okay. Just now we're on top. else over here see something yeah, over there we take pride in to take on new challenges to become more than the to be talk to the supervisor to see if you need to <laughs> Love that grenade shot. Error 83. Oh man, my armor's gone. That didn't take long. Access denied. Yellow security limits required. Some funky hologram going on here. That's locked as well. Something up there. Yep. Laser beams don't seem too good for my health. Hope I don't get crushed in here. Oh jeez. <laughs> Fire out. Oh god. C is crouch. It's always it's always one or the other. It's left or le uh, left control or it's C.
Oh, that's coming this way. Oh, would you shut up? Shut your mouth. Oh, right, I gotta go down there. Okay. Let's throw this out. Oh, man. That's a lot of ammo. That's a lot of ammo. Access denied. Yellow security clearance required. Okay, we really got to find this yellow access code. Entry locked. Demand presence at park safe mode. Destroy gore nest. Find key. That really upsets him, doesn't it? They don't like it when you do that. Throw a grenade. That chainsaw split that ammo out. That guy just teleported in there, didn't he? God. God. Demand presence eliminated. Lockdown disengaged. In he goes. Take a look around while that we wait for that. Did we come through? Did we come? Yeah, we. No, we came through this. Take us on a ride. There's our friend. Oh, there's an upgrade thing. Uh, so I gotta choose between this and this. I've already got this. I guess I get that one. Hold the weapon mod button to charge up three. Okay. So how do I go back to the other one? An Argent charge compression reloader. Allows the operator to automatically fire up to three rounds. Okay. Oh, okay. If you have two mods, you can press R. Ah, oh, cool. Takes a little split second to switch between the two. Explosive shot. Ch 
charged burst, right. Oh, we'll give it a go. Actually, we got another... Oh, I've got two points, I need another point. There's the yellow. Oh! <laughs> Stay down, bunk! Bloody hell, this guy. This bloke. Hey, this fella. From out of nowhere. This one's locked. Stay down. <laughs> Stay down there. The hell's that noise? The world is counting on us. How committed are you? Alright, through the yellow one. Welcome to the UAC's Mars installation, located in the vast Hellas Plain impact basin. This high-tech mining and research facility is pushing the boundaries of the imagination each and every day. As a valued employee, your loyalty is more than just a commitment to the UAC. It's a commitment to the future of mankind. Thank you for your service. I'll take that heavy assault rifle. Although recently superseded by the plasma rifle as the UAC standard issue weapon, the heavy assault rifle was still in widespread use due to its dependable mechanical firing mechanism, high accuracy at long range and an abundant supply of ammunition, the weapon is effective at all engagement distances and is best used against a solitary target. Unless a micro-missile modification is present, the standard issue ammunition, ammunition is a .50 caliber. Oh my god. <laughs> it's gonna do some damage. This thing's lit up and it's got a plus thing. I wonder if that's because I've got 100% health. Open airlock. Hang on a second, before we go though, I, I saw there was a... Hang on, hang on, where was it? There was an area that... Um, had like a, a flap there. Was it over here? That we could access? I mean, we couldn't access then, but now that we got the yellow card... I think it was yellow card access. Alright, don't bloody launch a grenade again. Did I just go around in a big loop? Access oh. granted. Here we go, here we go. Just some ammo. Access control. Area lockdown in effect for the security of you safety of UAC employees. Mandatory lockdown is in effect. Override. Okay. The hell did that do? I'd imagine I unlocked some things. Did I unlock some doors or something? Oh, here it is. Oh, crap. Oh! <laughs> Plasma! Looks like it did in uh, Doom 3. Oh, another way up. Hang on, there was something back down here. <laughs> Get that in ya. Hold Q to activate weapon selection. Oh, right, okay. 
maybe I shouldn't use that right now. Hang on to it. Praetor suit. Oh, okay, so we can upgrade this now. So what's dexterity? Switch weapons faster, grab ledges faster. Power up effective, can't click on that. Equipment system, decrease recharge duration for equipment. Area scanning. Auto map reveals exploration items in a wider radius. Secret sense, compass will pulse. When near, that probably be handy. Decrease explosive barrel and environmental damage taken. Decrease weapon self damage. Immune to explosive barrels. Well, let's go with this. I mean, I don't think I should be using the auto map that often, having a look at it. Seems a bit tough to use on the fly, but this might be good. The compass pulses, but I need to get there first, don't I? Uh, let's just hang on to it for now. I need two to spend on this thing anyway, so. I do have three points to use here, though. Speedy recovery. What about over here? Big boom. Let's get that. Had my eye on that. Even though I'm using a different mod at the moment. Alright, so we need more of these dudes. These dudes in their tokens. Database, Elite Guard. The Elite Guard is a company of security personnel charged with protecting the Lazarus Project, research, and maintaining order throughout the Argent facility. Their distinct red uniforms help to still a calming influence against UAC employees, and they are known to be level-headed, disciplined, and fair but firm. Their suits contain cybernetic augmentations, which give the elite guards an advantage should they need to quell any disturbances. The augmentations allow them to be faster, stronger, or more resilient to injury. Cool. Guess um, not enough though. Alright, so let's go over here. There was something else. Oh, we're back here, okay. Bloody hell, it's a bit of a maze, isn't it? So how the hell do I get in there? Welcome to the UAC's Mars installation. Located in the vast Hellas Plain impact basin, this high tech light facility is pushing the thousands of Oh, let's get it! Chuck a grenade. I shouldn't be so close to this barrel though. <laughs> Shot! Oh, damn, no escape. Punk's got a shield. Need a grenade. Oh! No good, no. What? Berserk. No. Punch that shield. Don't even bother with the shield. <laughs> come here, come here. Oh man. Brutal.
Come get some. <laughs> That's ridiculous. This is great. <laughs> Split him. This guy ain't messing around. Actually, I wonder if it's the same guy from Doom 3. I can't remember what happens at the end of Doom 3, but... It looked like we came out of a crypt right at the beginning there. And we got sealed away. Because there was Doom 3 and then there was an expansion. I don't remember what happens at the end of the expansion. Because you start off pretty ordinary. And then how does Doom 1 and 2 figure into it all? Where does this go? Looks like it goes to death, so I probably shouldn't follow that. Can I get up there? <laughs> I hope this is going somewhere. Don't think this is the way, but... They wouldn't have us go all the way up here if there wasn't anything here, right? Hey buddy, what you got up here? Something down here? Oh! <laughs> he just fist bump him. Uh. Oh. All right. Resuming alignment. Get this thing back online. I'm blocking your access to the facility scanner. Come to the Vega terminal, and I'll give you what you need. What? Power offline? I forgot. Haven't got the right one equipped. I was hoping they would come around the corner so I could use that. So what the hell was the point of going all the way up there? I don't even know how the hell I got up there. Was that... Was that lift open before? Did I... Was there something else up here? I feel like I went through a lot of effort for nothing. If you could just take that lift. Maybe that's what you're meant to do. I did find that secret though. Little Doom Marine. Well, I guess that's it. Let's go back out. Try not to die. We did take a massive leap before, though. Seem to survive that fall. We should be fine with this! Back compensation. Oh, let's climb that. Okay, 
Okay, it's gonna get back up top again. Shut up. <laughs> That's enough out of you. Up top. Going up, going up. other side. Just don't want to take that tumble. Oh, I don't know if it's worth the risk. It's pretty far down. Bet there's something really good there. <laughs> you take a lot of he took a lot of damage from the back there. Stay down. area by the way if you ever did go the opposite that other direction <laughs> you did actually take the jump found something over there let me know Shoot him behind his shield. <sighs> yeah, it's cool. Like, I don't know if you've played Doom 3, but I really liked its pacing. A lot slower, a lot more spookier. But this one's like, just running there, running there, beat the crap out of him. <laughs> he just doesn't care. He's beyond it. He's gone through it enough times. Alright. Seems to be so many passages. Ah, another suit. That's what I need. That's what I need. So, decrease the. I might actually go for that. Use our grenades a bit, uh, a little sooner. Munish our ammo crate. A lot of beeps and boops. Okay. So that's everything here. Moving right along. That central area is all lit up. The Vega Terminal. It's a gift. Take it. It will give you strength. Help you on your journey. If you can withstand the power surge. The Eye of Sauron.
greatly increases maximum health capacity. Route or route or route power to subsystem. So we'll go for some health first. That is pure Argent energy you've just taken into your system. It seems to agree with you. I will unlock the remaining Argent cells within the facility for you. Vega, give him what he wants. 61,337 UAC members deceased. 81% of the facility is on lockdown. Demonic presence through the Mars installation is critical. According to the records, Dr. Hayden, the invasion originated in the Lazarus facility. It seems that a hell wave was activated, transforming 64% of all UAC employees into the creatures you see roaming throughout the facility. The rest were killed by the demons released from their holding cells by Olivia Pierce. I feel I should apologize for what's happened here. Some of my employees took things too far. Olivia was the cause of all this, and I believe you will have to deal with her in time. You may not agree with our research, but know this. We exploited Hell and its resources because it was in mankind's best interest to do so. What you now see in this facility is the cost of progress. But none of that matters now. There is an emergency in the foundry. The regulators have been destroyed and the core temperatures are now destabilizing. They've overrun the adjacent facility. If the venting turbines aren't re-engaged, neither of us will survive the meltdown. Okay. Discover... what? Discover the cause. Well, I'm up here now. Oh, oh, there we go, a little dude. Chrome, oh, this is in the way. Heavy assault rifle model, bronze guy. What am I doing with all these things? Gotta hang on to them for later. down here nope all right over to the other side 